Hello, good morning. We are live. Um, and this is the second day of the first um, for many sessions that we'll have for um, HBCUs to get ready for the elections, not just this year in November 2020, sure that um, there's an infrastructure for every year in a conversation. My name is Christina Sanders. I am a senior program manager at the Andrew Goodman Foundation. And I won't take too long, but I have to acknowledge our amazing partners um, and um, our campus hosts, of course. Their team has been helping us figure out this platform, um, get the president involved, and you'll see a cool video soon about that also. Um, and uh, to the teams, the campus teams, our ambassadors who are at historically black colleges and universities that have been helping to organize this and make sure everything is working, the ADF staff, um, to the Students Learn, Students Vote Coalition, an amazing coalition that we hope to get you networked into, as well as Campus Vote Project, who is going to uh, present many things to you today about uh, digital strategy and getting involved and engaged that way. Um, and then also to Facebook for giving us the resources to be able to um, produce and promote this event for you. And they will be here this afternoon to share a session about how to engage your campus on Instagram, which you love, oh, I like it too, uh, and Facebook, which we're underutilizing uh, in order to make sure everybody gets what they need, the education, the information, get registered, get educated, and go vote. So, um, but before we do that, we have to, ha well, I, I need you to meet our amazing executive director at the Andrew Goodman Foundation. She is a fellow HBCU graduate. I should have said that first. I am a proud two-time alum of the Texas Southern University from Houston, Texas. Um, and Alexandria, you can share where you're from as well. All right, Christina, thank you so much. I wanna echo all the things that you just offered, but I wanna thank you for everything you've done. You've worked tirelessly and this wouldn't be possible without you. So thank you to all of our co-hosts and to all of our sponsors and all of our partners. As Christina said, I'm Alexandria Harris. I'm the executive director of the Andrew Goodman Foundation. And it's a great honor to participate in this summit today. As people who have attended an HBCU, or who are currently attending an HBCU know, it's a very special experience. Shout out to Spelman College. The pride that we feel, the history that we know, the parties that we go to, the way that the financial aid office works, but most importantly, the feeling of family. And since I'm among family, I don't mind saying that we have a very steep hill to climb right now. Um, and right now we're in the midst of a global pandemic. Right now we see black men being lynched in the street by police. Right now, black women are being shot in their beds by police. The South is underwater and the West Coast is literally on fire. So I don't have to tell y'all to vote because I know if you're here, you're going to vote. But it's important that you are mobilizing your people to vote. Your teammates, your roommate, your sorors, your frat, your little cousin and them. It's really, really important. And it's never been more important. And I think that right now what we're experiencing, what we're hearing the most is why, why should I vote? So you have to be prepared to have those conversations with your folks and talk to them about why, if you don't go out and vote that you don't count. And that really, if you don't vote, nothing's going to change. That the judges will be the same. The attorney generals will be the same. We'll continue to go to jail in mass numbers that the stand your ground laws will remain the same, the no knock search warrants will remain the same and so on and so on and so on. It's time now, the people are you, you're the superhero that we've been waiting for. So let's go and let's get the work done. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> 